Hold it on there like that. Okay, right. gods that you cheer on and the Bible's clear in God's law it says thou shall have no other gods before me thou shall have no other gods before me but your God is booze your God is the bucks your God is is a god of the devil that's what it is you follow the devil that's who you follow and you're following him straight to the furnace straight to hell as therefore the tears are gathered together and burned in the fire so shall it be at the end of the world when the Son of Man, the Son of Man, shall send his angels to gather out of his kingdom all things that offend, and them which do iniquity, they shall be cast into a furnace of fire. There will be wailing and gnashing of teeth. That's what you got looking forward to, buddy. Hell fire when you die, sinner. Hell fire when you die because you love your food. You love the fucks and you hate God by how you live, by how you act, by how you talk. You hate the Lord and that's why you're going to burn in hell. Because you won't repent. You better fear God, you wicked witch. You're going to die and go to hell. Turn from your sin. Turn from your sin. Stop breaking the law of God, you idolaters, you lovers of pleasure, you lovers of this world. The Bible says, God hath not given us a spirit of the world, but a spirit of God. God doesn't give you a spirit of the world when you get right with him. He gives you his spirit, and his spirit hates sin. The Bible said that the fear of the Lord is to hate evil. The fear of God is to hate evil. You don't hate evil, you love evil. You love drunkenness. You love to party it up. You love to booze it up. You love to watch your porn. You love to masturbate. You love to look and lust and lie. You love to worship other gods. You're gonna get hell fire for your sin. If you don't turn to Jesus Christ, you're going to get hell fire for your sin. You're going to receive the just recompense, the wage for your sin. Drop your glasses on the ground. Somebody drop their glasses on the ground right there. Somebody drop their glasses on the ground. The Bible says the wages of sin is death. But the Bible says the soul that sinned it shall die. If you continue in your sin, you're going to die. You're going to burn in hell. Jesus must be Lord. That's what you say now as you live like the devil, sinner. Your, your God is the cowboys. That's who your God is. You can't serve both. Is that a 10th commandment or 11th? Exactly. It's not in the Bible, sinner. It says, judge righteous judgment. That's what Jesus said. And we're here to judge you in your wicked ways. That you might turn. 
she might turn. You are a sinner. Her unforgiveness. So my friend. Friend. I'm born again. I'm a saint. You are a sinner. The Bible says I'm holy. I'm not a sinner. You're 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 a sinner. I'm born sinner. again. Hallelujah. You are a sinner. I live holy. You I live upright. I live in this pure. world. You, you live are a sinner. Sin. You love the you cross. Live in That's this your world, God. And you are That's a your sinner. God, you drunk. My, You're going to burn. Hey, listen, You're going to touch me. My drunk. God is in heaven. Your God's the devil. My God is in heaven. Your God's the devil. My God saved me. Your God's your booze. My God, God saved booze. me when you're I was drunk. 17. You're drunk. No, you're I'm not, ass white. There's your filthy mouth, too. Hey, you're, you're an ass white. You're going to burn you're it You're an ass white. Time, go to hell. No, I'm drunk. not. I am not. I am you're saved. I am saved. Sober up. I am saved. Sober up I am right. saved beyond you. Sober up and get right. I am saved beyond you. you. Sober up and get hey, right. no. I'm not a drunk. Yeah, you are. Yeah, you are a drunk. I smell it all over your breath. You're a wicked child of the devil. You're going to get hellfire, and you need to repent. Bible says repent, you therefore be converted, that your sins may be blotted out when the times of refreshing shall come from the presence of the Lord. And he shall send you Jesus Christ, whom we preached among you, whom the heavens must receive until the times of restitution of all things which wow. God has spoken by the mouth of all his holy prophets since the world began. And you better fear the Lord. You better depart from evil. You think you're a drunk going in to the kingdom of God? You're a liar. You're going to be cast out. You're going to be cut asunder. You're going to be cut in half by the king of kings and the Lord of lords. This nation needs to fear God. This nation needs to fear the Lord Jesus Christ. There's no such thing as a drunk Christian. There's no such thing as a fornicating whore or a whoremonger Christian. There's no such thing as a porn-watching Christian. There's no such thing as an idolater Christian. There's no such thing as a covetous Christian. You need to repent, you need to forsake all your sin, and you need to trust in Jesus and live for Him, obey Him, Live holy before God, or you're going to get hell fired. Yes, sinners go to hell. Sinners go to hell. Jesus said, I came not to call the righteous, but sinners to repentance. See, there's the righteous, there's the wicked, there's the holy, and there's the sinners. And sinners go to hell. Little children let no man deceive you he that doeth righteousness is righteous even as he is righteous he that commits sin is of the devil he that commits sin is of the devil for the devil sinneth from the beginning if you're committing sin you don't love Jesus Christ if you're committing sin, the Bible says you're of the devil. It says you're of the devil. You need to hear it as loud as it can get, sinner. That's right. You need to hear it as loud as you can get. Amen. One day, you might That's lift right. up your eyes in hell and beg for me to preach again. And beg for me to preach again. You won't get that chance if you go there, sinner. That's why you better fear God tonight. Because you might die tonight. You might get hell tonight. You might not come out. You might not make it home tonight alive. You might get clipped by a drunk driver tonight. One of these drunks in here might kill you tonight, coming out of here. You drunkards, you pot smokers, you filthy mouth porn watchers are gonna burn. You're gonna burn in the furnace. You're gonna go to hell. You're gonna get hell. You're gonna mash in hell. You're gonna wail and weep in hell, you idolaters. You enemies of God, you haters of God. You better turn to Jesus Christ before you burn. That's right. You better turn to Jesus Christ before you get the wrath of God. The wrath Wicked. of God is revealed from heaven against all oh, yeah. ungodliness. All ungodliness. So says a cigarette-sucking Christian, right? So says you, cigarette-sucking sinner. You're a child of the devil. You're a child of the devil. Sucking on your cigarettes. No such thing as a cigarette-sucking Christian. No such thing. Haven't met one yet. Haven't met one yet. Haven't right. met somebody who smoked cigarettes that didn't have any other sins in their life. Right. Haven't met them yet. Because there's no such thing 
is a cigarette sucking Christian. There's no such thing as a drunk Christian. There's no such thing as a pot smoking Christian. There's no such thing as a fornicating or warmonger Christian. There's no such thing as a porn watching Christian. There's no such thing as a covetous Christian. There's no such thing as an idolatrous Christian. There's no such thing as an unclean, lascivious, uh, filthy dog Christian. No, you've got to live holy. You've got to be born again. You got to turn from all your iniquities. The Bible said this. For the foundation of God stand is your having this seal. The Lord knoweth them that are his. And let every man that nameth the name of Christ depart from iniquity. Jesus Christ being made perfect became the author of eternal salvation. All those that obey him. You don't obey God. You obey sin. You don't obey God. You obey the flesh. And the Bible says, if you live after the flesh, you're going to die. If you live after the flesh, ye shall die. You sow into the flesh, you're going to reap corruption. You sow you need Jesus Christ, sir. You need to obey Jesus Christ. You need to obey Jesus Christ. You can say Jesus, but if you're not obeying him, it doesn't matter. If you're living in sin, you're an enemy of God. Jesus said, go and sin no more. Go and sin no more. The Bible says, whosoever abideth in him sinneth not. The Bible says, whosoever is begotten, but begotten of him, teacheth himself, and that wicked one toucheth him not. The Bible says, hereby we do know that we know him, if we keep his commandments. He that saith, I know him, and keepeth not his commandments is a liar and the truth is not in you you're not a christian if you're getting drunk you're not a christian if you're getting high you're not a christian if you have filthy f-bombs coming out of your mouth you're not a christian if you're watching porn you're not a christian if you're a filthy masturbator you're not a christian if you look and look and lie cheat steal you're not a christian if you're a filthy punk you're gonna burn in hell you're gonna burn in hell. So says a guy going to the buck stage. You gotta shut your mouth and get right with God. You gotta yeah. sit rock your mouth and get right. You gotta turn from your wicked way. You people, your gods are the bucks. Your God is the cowboy. That's who your God is. And you're gonna face the God of the Bible and judge you. You're gonna face the God of the Bible and judge me. You're gonna be under the wrath of God. I'm ready, Bucks man. You're not. That's the difference between me and you. I've surrendered to Jesus Christ. I live for Jesus. I don't live for the sin. I don't live for the world. Yeah, so says the drunk. You better get right with God, you drunk. Filthy drunk, you're going to burn in hell. You better repent. You better fear God. You better wake up. You better sober up. You people better sober up. Judgment's coming. You better sober up. Sober up. Judgment's coming. You better wake up out of your sleep before you wake up in hell. You better wake up out of your sleep before you wake up in the flames and fires of hell. Turn to Jesus Christ. Believe on the Son of God. He that believeth on the Son hath everlasting life. He that believeth not the Son shall not see life. But the wrath of God, the wrath of God abideth on him. You're going to get the wrath of God for being a drunk. You're going to get the wrath of God for being a homo, a sodomite, a lesbian, a baby murderer, a porn watcher, a cigarette sucking sinner. You're going to get the wrath of God for your sin. That's why you need to turn to Jesus Christ. That's why you need to make Jesus Lord. Stop making the Bucks Lord. Stop making the Cowboys Lord. And start making Jesus Christ Lord. Take yourself off the throne. Dethrone yourself and let Jesus reign. Woe unto them that call evil good, good evil. That put light for darkness, darkness for light, bitter for sweet, sweet for bitter. Woe unto you who are wise in your own eyes and prudent in your own sight. Woe unto you who are mighty to drink wine, and men of strength to mingle strong drink, who justify the wicked for reward. 
and take away the righteousness of the righteous from him. Therefore, as the fire devoureth the stubble, and the flame consumeth the chaff, so their roots shall go up as rottenness, and their blossom as the dust, because they have despised the law of the Lord. You have despised the law of God, and you have cast away the words of the Holy One. You have despised God's word, that's why you live in sin. You despise God's word, that's why you're under the law. That's why you're under condemnation. That's why you're already condemned. That's why you follow the devil. That's why you worship the bucks. That's why you worship the cowboys. You love sin. You love sin. You love sin. We can perish. That's what Jesus says to you wicked people. Repent or perish. That's what Jesus has for you. Repent or you will perish. You're going to burn. Sinner. You're going to burn. Better get right with God. Repent or perish. Repent or perish. It's quite simple. But you love sin. You love iniquity. And you're going to get the wrath of God for your sins. That's a fearful thing. That's a fearful thing, you idolater. Yes, you, number 11. I'm talking to you. You're in trouble with God. It's time to repent. It's time to fear God and keep His commandments. Fear God and keep His commandments. For this is the whole duty of man. For God will bring every work into judgment with every secret thing. Whether it be good or evil, God is coming back to judge the quick and the dead. Behold, the day of the Lord cometh, which shall burn as an oven, and all the proud, yea, all that do wickedly shall be a stubble, and the day that cometh shall burn them up. It shall neither leave them root nor branch. It's not going to leave you root nor branch, Jesus. It's going to uproot the wicked and cut off the wicked. He's going to uproot the evil doer and cut off the wicked in their iniquity. But unto you who fear my name shall the Son of Righteousness arise with healing in his wings, and ye shall grow up and go forth as the calves of the stall, and he shall tread down the wicked, and they shall be as ashes under the soles of his feet. In the day God says, when I shall do this, God's going to tread down the wicked. God's going to tread the winepress of his fierceness and wrath on the drunks. God's going to cut off the lesbians and the homos. God's going to cut off the baby murderers. God's going to cut off you sports idolaters and cast you into hell. That's what God will do. That's why you should repent. That's why you should humble yourself. That's why you should submit yourself, therefore, to God. Resist the devil, and he shall flee from you. From night to God, and he will draw nigh unto you. Cleanse your hands, you sinners. Cleanse your hands, you sinners. Repent from your sin. Turn from your sin. Forsake your wicked ways. Forsake your wicked ways. Stop being a drunk. Stop being a porn watcher. Stop masturbating. Stop being a pot smoking, cigarette sucking sinner. Turn from your evil way before you get God's wrath. Before you get God's wrath, sinner. You better fear Almighty God. You better fear the one whom after he has killed has body, has power to cast body into hell. He has power to cast soul and body into hell. That's who you need to fear. You need to fear Jesus Christ. You need to repent, mocker. God's not mocked. God's not mocked. Whatsoever a man soweth, that shall he also reap. And you people are sowing into your flesh. 
You people are sowing unto your flesh. You people love to please your flesh. Know ye not that to whom you yield yourselves servants to obey, his servants ye are to whom you obey, whether of sin unto death or obedience unto righteousness, you commit sin unto death. If we sin willfully after we receive the knowledge of the truth, there remaineth no more sacrifice for sins except the expectation of a fearful judgment and fiery indignation which shall devour the adversary. God calls you as adversary. God calls you as enemy because you choose sin. You choose iniquity. You choose vanity. You choose to break the law of God. You choose to do it. You choose to do it. And you do not choose the fear of the Lord. You don't choose the fear of the Lord. Therefore, your destruction shall come as a whirlwind. Therefore, distress and anguish shall come upon you. Because he has called, you have refused. He has stretched out his hand, and you did not regard it. Then you will seek him early. You will not find him. You will call upon God. He will not answer you because you did hated knowledge and you did not choose to fear God. You chose to live in sin. You chose to live in so iniquity. The Bible says in Proverbs 10, 16 that the fruit of the wicked is to sin. That's your fruit. That's what you produce. That's what you bring forth. Corruption. That's what you bring forth evil that's what you bring forth drunkenness that's what you bring forth idolatry that's what you bring forth a filthy potty mouth and a filthy mind porn watching that's what you people do time to repent repent and be baptized every one of you in the name of jesus christ for the remission of sin and he shall receive the gift of the holy ghost the holy ghost isn't in there the Holy Ghost isn't in the Bucks game. The Spirit of God is not in the Bucks game. Just the Spirit of the world. This is the broad path that leads to hell. That's the broad path that leads to hell in there. And you're marching your way to destruction. You're marching your way to the furnace. Because you love sin and you hate Jesus Christ. You hate Jesus Christ because you're drunks. You hate Jesus Christ because you're idolaters. You hate Jesus Christ because you watch porn. You hate Jesus Christ because you suck on your weed and suck on your cigarettes. And you love to worship Tom Brady and the Bucks. You hate Jesus and God's going to cast you into hell. Except you turn, don't touch me. Except you turn. Jesus Christ said repent or perish. Jesus Christ said accept your man you will perish. The Bible said that except a man turn from all this man will not receive forgiveness of God. You're not going to receive forgiveness of God. You're no different than the world. You're no different than the world. You're no different than the world. You're just like the world. And the Bible says, come out from among them and be separate, saith the Lord. Touch not the unclean thing and I'll receive you. You touch what's unclean. You do wickedness. You sow into unrighteousness because you're a child of the devil. You need to give out with God, you wicked worker of iniquity. Yeah, you're a worker of iniquity. I know you by your fruit. And your fruit is evil. Your fruit is of the world. And that's why you're going to burn, because you've got a spirit of error. you got a spirit of witchcraft. you got a spirit of idolatry. You've got a spirit of idolatry. You've got a spirit of idolatry, idolater. You're a cowboy's idolater. You're a cowboy's idolater, and you can't serve two masters. The only fool is you, sinner. The only fool is you, sinner. God hates you in your sin. Wake up. God hates all workers of iniquity. God hates all workers of iniquity. Psalm 5.5. 5. Go read your Bible. Oh, so says the guy with the beer on his breath. You need to get right. Get right with God, you wicked drunk. Child of the devil, you enemy of God. You need to repent. You need to really read it again. Read it again. You obviously didn't read it. You are, no, the only fool is you going in there. The only fool is in there going in there, right there. You're going to burn. You're going to burn, sinner. You better repent. You better fear God. You're going to get God's wrath. You're a fake. You're a fake. You're a hypocrite, and your sin has found you out. Go and sin no more. You're a fake. 
You're a hypocrite. You're a fake. That's right. I'm possessed with the Holy Ghost. You don't recognize it because you're not of God. You're not of God. You're an enemy. And God's going to cut you down. God's going to cut you down. God's going to trample you. God's going to trample you underfoot. You fake. You hypocrite. You phony. God of the devil. So says the guy with the cowboy shirt on. So says the guy with the cowboy shirt on. Get right with God. Get right with God. You're blaspheming God right now. You're blaspheming the Holy Ghost. God's going to take you straight to hell if you don't repent. You're going to perish. You're going to perish. You better. You don't fear God. You don't fear God. You don't fear God. And that's why you're going to hell. You don't love God. You're a liar. You're a liar. You're a liar. You don't love God. And the truth is not in you. You're a liar. And the truth is not in you. You're a fake, you're a hypocrite, you're a phony. That's your friend drunk right now. You better rebuke him. You won't do it though because you're a fake. You go hand in hand with the wicked. You go hand in hand with the wicked. You're not going unpunished, sinner. You're going to burn. You're going to burn because you love your sin. You love your sin. You love your sin. And you're going to hell. You're going to hell. You better fear God. You better fear God. You better fear God. You better fear God, sinner. You better fear a holy God wiping you out. You better fear a holy God wiping you out, you fake. God's going to destroy you. God's going to destroy you. God hates all workers of iniquity. God's angry with the wicked every day. You're going to have to deal with those scriptures. You're going to have to deal with the word of God. God says, I love them that love me. You don't love God going in there worshiping your football team. You love your sin. That's what you love. You love idolatry. That's what you love. You love iniquity. You drink it down like it's water. A lot of you people, a lot of you people, you drink your iniquity down like it's water because you're full of hate for God. You hate the word of God. You love your sin and you're going to get hell if you don't repent. Time to turn. God says, I love them that love me. And the only way to love God is to obey him. This is the love of God that we keep his commandments. His commandments are not graven. Anybody tells you they're a Christian when they're drunk, they're a fake. Anybody tells you they're a Christian watching porn, masturbating, they're a fake. Anybody tells you they're a Christian and they worship the Bucks and they worship the Cowboys, they're a fake. Be assured that your sin will find you out. That man's upset. His sin found him out. Your sin's going to find you out. Jesus Christ ain't some little long-haired, sissy, effeminate, blue-eyed, uh, Catholic uh, Jesus that they give you in the Roman Catholic Church. Jesus Christ is coming back on a white horse with flame, a fire in his eyes, and a double-edged sword, and he's gonna break, he's gonna, he's gonna crush the wicked underfoot. That's what Jesus Christ is gonna do. That's the Jesus. You better turn to Jesus now and receive mercy. You better turn to Jesus now and receive grace. You better turn to Jesus now before you get the wrath of God. Before you get the wrath of God before you get the lake of fire. You people are marching your way to the lake of fire. You're going to the lake of fire. We're going to the fire. You love sin. You love Shut up. Shut up. Well, we got your pool. You love iniquity. You don't love sin. Well, we got your pool. You don't love God, you love your sin, you love the devil. You're of your father, the devil. You're all of your father, the devil. And you're going to burn with the devil, except you repent. You're going to burn with the devil, except you forsake him. You're going to burn with the devil, with the devil except you repent. Except you forsake your sin. Except you turn from your sin. Except you give up with God. Except you forsake your sin. You're going to get God's wrath. You're going to get the indignation and fury of God, except you turn to the Lord Jesus Christ. Jesus said, I say unto you. Praise God. That was good conviction. Yes. He's under heavy. Oh, Pray yeah. for that guy. Pray for that man. He was under heavy conviction. I say unto you, therefore, you shall die in your sin. 
breath, you do not believe that I am he, Jesus said, he shall die in your sin. You want to go again, bro? Then turn to Jesus and live. No, not if you're living in sin, you're not. You need to put out that filthy cigarette, man. You're not free from sin. You're living in sin. You're living in sin. You're living in sin. You need to, yeah, I am judging. Jesus said, judge righteous judgment. John 7, 24. You ever read the Bible? Well, why, why don't you recognize it when it's being preached? The Bible says, cry aloud, spare not, lift up thy voice like a trumpet. Another Bible verse. Another Bible says, cry aloud, spare not. The Bible says, wisdom. Wisdom cries. Wisdom cries. You don't recognize it because you're not of God. I know, that's why you still smoke cigarettes. You gotta put it down, man. No, you need to do it now. No, don't say I'm going to. You might not get the later. You might not get the later. No one knows the later is. Oh, man. You might not get the later. You gotta turn it around. It doesn't matter what my name is. You need to have a God. Put that out. I'm here to argue. I'm here to answer. I'm here to tell you. Because I'm talking about what you're doing. I'm a secret. I'm a God. Put your soul in the church. You're listening just fine. You came over here now. You came over here now. So listen to what I'm saying. I don't want you to go to hell. My name's Alan. You're going to burn in hell, Victor. You're going to burn in hell. This is true. You repent. You might do it later. You can't go to hell. The Bible says I have no fellowship with the unfruitful works of darkness, but rather reprove them. Sake your way, man. Sake your way, man. No, don't do, do it now. Don't wait, man. No, don't do it now. Yes, go home. Go home and get right with God. Go home and get right with God now. Don't do it later. Don't do it. You may not have later, man. You may not have later.